The Time Up and Go is a test of functional mobility and balance. The great thing about Time Up and Go is it can be done in a clinic or in your own home. You just need a friend to be with you when you do it. So what you need to do for the test is that you need a chair, approximately 46 centimetres height, with arms or without arms, that doesn't really matter in this case. You just need a space about three metres long, so that could be your corridor in your kitchen or maybe your hallway. You need a stopwatch or just a mobile phone with a timer. And essentially that's all the kit that you really need. Now, in order to do the test, we recommend that you have someone with you, just in case. So, to begin the test, you should sit on the chair with your back right back in the chair so you're comfortable, arms resting. When you're ready, we would ask the person to stand up, walk three metres at their comfortable pace to a marker set out on the floor, turn around, come back and sit down. The timing starts when the person starts to attempt to stand on the word go and the timing stops as soon as the person's bottom hits the chair. If the individual can do the test less than 15 seconds, that's a fairly healthy gait speed. However, if the test takes longer than 15 seconds, it does suggest that they may be at risk of having a fall. We would recommend that if you have a timed up and go of more than 15 seconds, then that is a sign that maybe you should be starting to think about being more active and getting stronger. One of the ways of doing that is going to see a physiotherapist who would then carry out a comprehensive assessment around your balance, your strength and your walking and be able to provide you guidance about the type of activities and exercise that you could do to help reduce your risk of falls.